Hello, hello again. Um, I have now made it to my destination in Rousson, um, which I will drop in the link below because I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. I am actually in the parking lot now for the Ocher Trail, which is supposed to be an incredible sight to see. Um, they make these beautiful, beautiful paint pigments from kind of the orange kind of dramatic cliffs that they have here in Rousson. So I thought I would do a really short little kind of hike and walk around to kind of see it in person because um, um, in the pictures and the reviews that I read, it looks incredibly cool and um, it almost looks like you're in Mars. So let's see what it's like. Um, it is pretty hot out, but I think I can tough it out for 30 minutes um, and I've got my hat just in case. So let's go see it. A visit to the Ocher Trail should absolutely be combined with a visit to the gorgeous town of Rousson, which you can see here. It is absolutely charming and makes a great stop for lunch or ice cream. So you see that on your left as you exit the parking lot. And if you want to visit the Ocher Trail, make a right and follow the path up. I was impressed that it was only two euros and 50 cents to visit the Ocher Trail for an adult ticket and that children under 10 are free. Note though that you can pay seven euros and 50 cents if you also want to visit the nearby conservatory, but I just opted for the Ocher Trail. So without further ado, let's begin my hike on the Ocher Trail. As you notice here on the screen, be prepared to climb a lot of stairs, plus up and down hills and some uneven terrain. But here we go, let the adventure begin. Hello again. So I have opted to do the shorter of two trails in the Ocher Trail. Um, there are two trails, one that is 35 minutes long, which is the shorter one, and there is another one that is about one hour long, which is, as you guessed it, the longer one. So I've decided to do the shorter one, and um, yeah, so far so good. Hello, hello. I am on the Ocher Trail in Roussan right now. I've managed somehow to get a stretch of this trail without anyone behind me, but I do think they're coming. But so far, so good. It's really hot out, but it's beautiful. This bright orange kind of like hue to everything is just stunning and anchored with the trees. It's lovely. It is, um, a pretty basic hike, but I definitely would recommend bringing sneakers as I feel like I would be slipping and sliding around otherwise. So some people are coming, so I'm gonna sneak and get ahead so I don't get stuck with them. All right, see you soon. Just to show you a little view of what we're walking in, it is this Kind of really kind of light orange brownish hued sand much darker than the sand that you might normally see at the beach and it definitely does um, in some parts of the trail feel like you're walking on kind of a sandy beach so while I'm wearing ballet flats for most of my travels around Provence today I decided to wear these sneakers and I'm so happy that I brought these with me um, and also just be prepared for whatever footwear you have to get dirty because my shoes are definitely getting covered in this orangey kind of sandy dust. So I just finished my hike on the Ocher Trail. 
definitely not 35 minutes long. They're probably factoring in time for you to take a lot of pictures along the way, which I definitely did, um, but I'd probably say it's no more than like a 15, maybe 20 minute walk, depending on how you, well you do with the stairs and climbing up the hill at the end. But I would say it was really fun. I would absolutely do the longer one if it wasn't 90 degrees out today and boiling hot. Um, I'm probably showing sweating on my face right now, but that's okay. Um, I really enjoyed it and would highly recommend it if you're looking to do something a little bit different in Provence. Thank you so much for watching my vlog on hiking the Ocher Trail. If you liked this vlog, I would absolutely love it if you could like it, leave a comment, or subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will be regularly posting more content like this as well as my other travel adventures. Thank you again for watching.